Hey guys, I hope you're having a beautiful day. Today is rescue day. They're pulling up right now and we're about to take in some dogs from them. Here they are. One of my favorite rescues all the way from Texas, Apollo Support and Rescue. Like most rescues and shelters, we're completely full right now. And of course, Texas yeah. has been and still is in a rescue crisis. All right, well, we got some babies for you. Oh, I personally fostered these guys and I'm in love. I just don't know why they don't get adopted. But they're going to be way better off here. They couldn't get adopted? No. They've been on that finder for uh, two months. Two months available for adoption. They're Gray Pyramids, uh, Golden Retriever, Antolian Shepherd. Um, what else are you? 100% rescue, right? A big kid. Is he a CH? Is he the one with? Yes, that's the one with the um, cerebellar hyperplasia. Yep. Yeah. He's doing very, very well. Oh, he has poop on himself, but. You're part, you know. That's yep. okay, you poop. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Maybe say mom give it bother? Oh my god. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> Look at your thing! Oh my god! It's okay. So these two, Lori and Zeke, were part of five that were in this closed area that says high electrical lines. And our foster crawled in there and saved them. Oh my god. She was like, oh yeah. Lori? <laughs> This is Lawyer's the sister. Oh. I swear that he looks like it almost has like whipped it in. Yeah, I was gonna say. Um, I'm gonna get big gold. Okay, around. is this all the ones on this side? Yes. So we can check this. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Boy. And there we, all three of their siblings, got dumped behind our property. He hasn't been in with these puppies yet. And he has been with other dogs, not this group. Okay. So this one is Wobbles. He has he has cerebellar hypoplasia, but not as bad as Matilda or Janie. Not even close to as bad. He's just just a little wobbly, a little shaky. He's very cute. So so far, ten of our dogs are out. There's seven new rescues. And ideally, the newer rescues would be sticking around around us, but because they're so excited, they've been in a van for a long time and everything, they're very spread out, moving around. Obviously you can, those are the puppies barking, the Great Pyrenees puppies. Here's a good example, that dog Jay right there, is doing a great job setting boundaries. You're gonna see, see how he'll hold his position, and he's showing some teeth. I want you to check out, check this out. See, growling. My dogs will most likely, hopefully, respect it and back up. And hooch. Now, I'm not going to go over there. And the reason I'm not going to go over there is because he's in a position of letting the dogs know to stay away from him. If I walk over there, it's telling my dogs that it's okay to disrespect what he's wanting. Since I'm doing it, they're going to think it's okay, right? So I'm not going to go over there. But notice how they all got away from him. So it's important that not only the dogs listen to the new dog, and that the dogs respect boundaries, you must also respect boundaries.
come out of his shell. This does not mean at all that he doesn't like other dogs. This just means he needs a little bit of time to decompress and trying to find his role. Kiki's here now. Almost, I think half the dogs are here now. It's okay if he comes to me, but I don't want to come to him because I don't want to bring more dogs over there than necessary. You know, you don't really want to be saying much at all. Just let them all meet, keep the energy cool, pay attention to what's going on, don't freak out, listen, try to relax. All right, most of the dogs I've met now use wobbles. Use wobbles. Oh my gosh, look at wobbles on Kiki. That is so cute. There's Bentley. It's pretty much all the dogs. Maybe five or six more, seven more. Olive. All right, guys. It's a beautiful, hot, sunny day. All of the dogs have met. All of the dogs are out. All of the dogs have met the new dogs. It was a successful meet and greet. They're all just getting water together now. All right, we're just gonna hang out for a little bit. I'm gonna get off my phone. Enjoy my time with the pups and the new pups, of course. And once it cools down, we'll go on a pack walk. And it's going to be beautiful. I can already tell it's going to be great. And I'll check in with you in a few hours.